Hello everyone, this is Man in the Black Hat, and I've been having some hardware issues. So for the moment, this will be the final Fable episode, until I can get Fable 2 working again. We're going to oh, talk to this guy. I was hoping you would return. The temple is in need of a protector once more. We have always suffered at the hands of the vile cultists from the Temple of Shadows. But I fear they're preparing a major attack against us. It would seem the Shadow Worshippers are planning to poison the holy water in the Wellspring Cave. If that happens, the Golden Oak will die. It would mean the end of our order, perhaps even the end of the village and all its people. You helped us once before. Will you do so again? Yeah, sure, we'll help you out. The light blesses us with your help again. Thank you. The first thing you must do is to check the statues from which the water pours forth. Ensure they haven't been contaminated with the taint of evil. The shadow worshippers are likely to target the main chamber next, but you mustn't allow them to desecrate it. As you can see, I now have a golden retriever because... <sighs> Pardon me! Because my, uh... My hero is now well into the good side of things. Good and pure. Because I haven't been eating that much meat. And I haven't been doing corrupt things like lazing about in bed all week. But anyways, like I said, this will be the end of the Fable 2 episodes until I can get it working again. If I get it working again, I will continue them alongside Fable 3. So you'll be getting um, two Fable 2... Ah! Get off me! be getting two Fable 2 episodes per week and one Fable 3 episode per week until Fable 2 is finished. Then it'll move on to... Nothing but Fable 3. Now... Just gotta go into the Wellspring Cave here and defeat the Shadow Temple. Once I get the issue resolved, and I will, then I will either have to catch up to where I was or I'll have some other stuff ready. We'll figure it out. I've gone past the point of being angry about this. And now I'm just trying to figure out how best to make sure that you guys get the entertainment that you deserve. So, once we go in here, we take a sharp left into our first combat zone. This is also going to be a very heavily assassin-laden place, because that's what the Temple of Shadows uses. By the way, you complete this quest, you can no longer ever go to the Temple of Shadows. And do their quests. So, Temple of Shadow, Temple Light is an either-or situation. Aiming, fire! And doink! Got him. Like you found out in the Crucible, these guys are really good at making sure that your life is a living hell because they're a lot tougher than bandits. However, they go down pretty quickly when you can actually get the damn spell off. Huh, I killed their leader. I don't actually have to kill these guys, but I'm going to anyways. Killing them reveals delicious, delicious XP. Boom. Just to make sure. It's one dead. Add accuracy. Yay, accuracy level three means I'm even more deadly. Hey, look! 
key. I didn't even notice that there before. Huh. Silver key. I'm sure leaving those dead bodies in the stagnant pool of water won't hurt things any. So we're going to move on. Don't mind me, I'm a little tired. And we're basically repeating what we did with Hammer in here. Only this time we get to be the people that kill things. I think I got two people with one shot there. And good night. Well, one good night. And oh, miss. That's one. Oh, good, they're all dead. Um. I'm not really prepping my character for the Spire so much as I'm prepping them for post-Spire. You get a pretty decent set of weaponry in the Spire. Which, if you're not fully prepared for post-Spire, can actually be better than what you carry before you go to the Spire. Fortunately, this master level repeater crossbow is pretty awesome. I guess I'm checking these corridors just in case there's something nice in them. Which there is not. As you can see. And we move to the last area where we will confront... You think you can stop me? That guy. I am channeling the natural energies of the wellspring. And feeding my unholy powers, I cannot be harmed. Slaughter him. Okay. Just where you ca oh, assassins. Yay, Whoopi. Die. Oh, I am hitting them. Damn. Blow through. <laughs> Okay. What are you going to throw at me now, Cornelius? And... Oh! Yeah, I can't hit him yet. Oh well, these things are susceptible to fire. Bye. Wow, I missed a bunch of them. Must be because I'm on an elevated platform. Huh, oh well. Doop a doo. Any more? Okay, I guess so. Beat the living crud out of these things. It can't be sanitary to be summoning all of these things into this area. What are you screaming about? Oh. That's what you're screaming about. Screw it. Kill this guy. From a distance, too. Ow. Okay, that's it. Oh! Nailed him. To the wall. Literally. <laughs> we... We heard the fighting. Is it really over? Oh, thank you so much. The Temple of Shadows will never recover from this. We are saved. You are a holy champion. 
sent to us by the light itself. Thank you again. Yay! We defeated the Temple of Darkness and Shadows and other things that aren't all lit up well. Yeah. Now we move on. I think. Hold on, this may take a bit. Loading, loading, loading. Loading, loading, loading. Keep them screams a loading. Ride. Holy crud. You know, I'm starting to think that my problems with this game started a bit earlier than this. That was a long loading screen. Anyway, it's best to go back up to... Or, I don't know where the hell I'm going. Oh... Uh... Do I have anything more that I need to do today? Oh, that's right, I need to go check that chest if I haven't emptied it already. That's what I'm gonna do. Totally gonna do that. Totally. Come on. We're going up the hill. Anyways, as of today, voting is officially closed on the hero of Fable 3's gender. So, officially, the voting is five votes for girl, two votes for boy. So, Silver 89, Essie, 12 Dutch Girl, Bladed Shotgun, and Inferno Wing, you get your wish. Sean and Mato Triple X, well, you guys should have convinced more people to vote. Oh well, that's how it crumbles. So Wednesday, look forward to the next ep exciting episode. Well, the first exciting episode, aside from when I kill this gargoyle. Of Fable 3. But that's not for now. For now, we're going to go back to the Crucible. Probably kill another gargoyle or five. And then go to the Spire. Which is apparently the Spire of Red Ring. Uh, okay. Yoopa doopa doo, yoopa doopa doo, yoopa doo. Running out of things to talk about. What else is there? Okay, let's see. I think I'm actually gonna... Oh yeah, I'm gonna buy this house. Hell yeah, my house. In the middle of our street, my house. That I'm renting out to you. Anyways... Let's see, there was... Nothing of interest, so I'm gonna go over to this guy. Mr. Carriage Driver, please get me to where I need to go, which is Westcliff! For 20 gold. And hold on, we'll be right back after this loading screen. Loading! We're so loading. Oh, hey! Welcome to Westcliff. 
I totally skipped ahead of some stuff in a in a silver chest because it was boring and repetitive. But hey, here we are. Anyways, onward. Got some minor stuff to do here, and then I will be on to the spire. Wanna know how evil Lucian is? Wanna know how evil Lucian is? Lucian is the reason my game won't load anymore. Didn't know that? Well, now you do. So, off we go. Going to check a few last things in this area. One of them being the silver chest. Am I going to play the stupid game over there? No. I'm not going to play the stupid game over there. Ooh, bewitching augment and a diamond. Nice. I will totally take those. And there's nothing I can really get over here, is there? Nope. This is just a shortcut, isn't it? Yep. Okay, fine. Skip past this. Shoot, shoot, Go over shoot. here, just in case. And win prizes too. Shut up, not interested. Is there anything in here that I can take? No? Really? Okay. For some reason I thought there was something grabbable in- GET OUT OF MY WAY, JERKS! Ooh! Holy crap! Anyways... Onward... And check just to make sure I don't have any other things I need to take care of. Augments. Witching and slash and burn. Hmm. Um. Meh. Yeah. Don't know what I'm going to wind up doing with those. Oh, that's right. Nothing. Assuming I don't get this problem fixed, which I will. I totally will. Let's see. Do -do 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 -do. Steel flintlock? No. Well, I got Master Katana in there, but I can't afford it. Darn. Oh well. Soon my dream will be fulfilled. Ah, good to have you back. Uh huh. Got anything new? No, of course not. Okay. I. You're always welcome in my store. Doubt you. Oh, you do have new stuff. Nothing that I want. There you are. Hey, Hammer. Ready to start your glorious military career, then? Did you convince your wife to wait for you? Okay, let's walk slowly with Hammer. Trust me, I'm tilting the stick as far as I can right now. Oh, eight gargoyle. You know the last thing I said to my father before I went to the ritual cave? I can't remember if I said goodbye that morning or not. That's the funny thing about goodbyes. You never know when you'll get another one. I'm sorry, I didn't mean... This isn't like that. You'll do great out there. Ma, uh -huh. That's nice, Hammer. No, nope, nothing over there. Move! Damn it. Why are you in my way? You should not be in my way. Oh, look. There's a, uh, there's a key over there. 
Slowly gonna go grab that. Slowly. Yay, silver key. <laughs> Yay, hammer's in my way again. Okay, come on. There's some other treasures around here too, but you can't get them until you come back right. here. No personal effects allowed on board, and no weapons, and no dogs. Don't worry. Great. I'll look after Furface here, and your stuff as well. Oh, fine. Might as well. On our way to the spire. Insert foreboding music here. Loading, loading, loading. A loading, loading, loading. Loading. Why are we loading? This game shouldn't take so long to go on. But we're still loading. We're always loading. Oh, cutscene. That is a big phallic object. <sighs> this ought to be fun. Just look at this place. We got Day one. Up with Lord Lucian. Whatever he's planning, me and Lil are going to be set for life. Tattered Spire. Getting moving so they don't push me. I've been with my little 13 years. Been and they push me anyways. What are you if you could for? see her, you'd understand why. Name's Bob, by the way. What Hi, is Bob. the noise? I don't just hear it. I don't care. I feel it. This place feels wrong. Uh-huh. Who could have built it? You're never going to shut up, are you, Bob? Oh well. Wow. Lag. What is this place? Six years I was a mason's apprentice. I lots and lots of lag. Like How is it possible? <laughs> yeah, I had a bunch of issues on that part. I should have seen this coming really wrong. from this part. Oh look. It's that bastard. The world outside these marvelous walls is a corrupt, rotting husk. Reason is absent. Instead of order, there is only chaos. Chaos does not punish evil, nor reward righteousness. Chaos cuts innocent lives short, and we're to accept this as fate. I beg to differ. You stand in the center of a great instrument of change. With it, I shall remake the world, and my creation shall be unrecognizable in its perfection. But my will alone is not sufficient for such a monumental task. It is only through your toil, through your labors, through your conviction that Albion will be transformed. Do not fear the sound you hear, the throbbing you feel beneath your feet. These sensations will soon be as familiar as your own heartbeat. And so long as your heart continues to beat, 
All that I require of you is obedience. Now. Wow, time has not been kind to him. And this is where Lucian completely corrupts my save files. Bastard. Week one. Morning, maggot. Welcome to the spire. Hope you like it, because you're never leaving. Right now, you're in the barracks. You'll eat and sleep here, and the rest of the time you will work, wherever the Commandant assigns you. Your job is keeping the scum building this place in line, and otherwise doing whatever the Commandant tells you without question. When you receive an order, you will obey it immediately. Which brings me to that new piece of jewelry oh, you lovely. got. The collar is part of Lord Lucian's obedience program. The Commandant will explain it to you. Main thing is Anyways, I'm going to completely so interrupt this guy and say that this is Man in the Black Hat. And, and I will see you on Wednesday for the start of Fable 3. Either. Now report to the Commandant. Later.